Well, we're gonna do something quite incredible right now. I drive it! Well, last night, Stubbsy got a rude awakening about 11 o'clock. Time for a payback. Did you get cut? Gosh. You all right? <laughs> Did you eat a rock? Are we going to school today? Yep. You know you're late? Yep. It's hard being a mom. Yep. Sweet. <laughs> Is it okay that I'm here? Goodbye, Everly. Yep. Have, Have a nice home. life. <laughs> All right, when I see you again, you'll be back to just Savannah, not mom yep. Savannah. All the work to be a teenage mom. Yep. Or a mom in general. Bye, I love you. Bye, I love you. I ran to the grocery store to get stuff for the ranch. And look, the hot air balloon landed right next to the grocery store. That is one thing I do like about fall, is all of the hot air balloons out in the morning. I like them cooler mornings and I just wish it would stay warm in the afternoon. I mean it has been in the 90s still so I'm not going to complain about that. This right now is perfect. Cool in the morning, hot in the afternoon and hot air balloons. It's conference weekend and Asbury asked if we were going to have cinnamon rolls and we're going to the ranch so I decided that I would make some today and bring them with us and then we can just warm them up. But I got frozen dough and that takes forever to heat up. But I just got something new. I got a dough mat and look at this cool thing. So you set it here, you turn it on, you put your dough on and it rises so much faster than the four hours, six hours, eight hours, whatever it says. The frozen, let's see. Yeah, so it says the refrigerated thaw is eight to 16 hours. I don't have eight to 16 hours. And it says the rise time is three to five hours. So we're gonna try out this dough mat and get it to rise faster so I can take it to the ranch. Okay, I put the dough mat to 120 degrees, put the cinnamon rolls on top. On the bag it says three to five hours. I'm gonna cut the time in half with this dough mat. Well, last night, Stubbsy got a rude awakening about 11 o'clock. Time for a payback. <laughs> Wake up, sugar! <laughs> well, we're gonna do something quite incredible right now. What is that? I don't know. You don't know what you're gonna do? So we got a little badger here. A lot of your cousins grew up riding this little, learning to ride this badger. Learning to ride a four-wheeler by driving this badger. So what do you think? You yeah. want to give it a try? Mm -hmm. Your first time ever riding the four-wheeler? Mm -hmm. Driving the four-wheeler? Okay. So what we're going to do is not be crazy. That's number one. Safety. This is your brake right here. Uh -huh. Okay. And this is your brake. Where your foot is is the brake. You are now in gear and watch what happens. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Let off the brake though. There you go, there you go. Nice and easy, don't go too fast. You're driving the four-wheeler, bud. Look at that. something we got to show Stubbsy and I told him he's not going to like it but he actually is going to love it. He's going to absolutely love it. Look what Charlie found. Woo! We got water. We got water coming in. It's, every time we have water coming in we get all excited about it. So, Dude you're doing so good. So the idea here is, is, is just to go really slow 
give him plenty of experience. And uh, if we go any faster, we're gonna have to put a helmet on, which is probably what we'll do here in a minute. But right now, we're not we're not going fast enough to hit anything, and he needs to be able to hear me. So as soon as we advance to Az's level, which you can see Az is right behind us doing so good, he needs to wear a helmet. But Az can't hear me very well right now because of the helmet. But but we're not gonna go very fast. But right now, it's just getting him comfortable with the throttle and the brake. And when I tell him to stop or slow down or go, then he knows what to do. Doing good. You're doing so good, As. The other thing here is, As is going to make some mistakes. As might hit a fence post, he might hit a tree, he might go into a ditch. But that's probably a good thing, so he can have more respect for the four-wheeler. Right now, he doesn't know what that thing's capable of doing in a negative way. So. We're gonna let him go around, putt around a little bit. We're gonna let him make some mistakes. It's okay. Because that four-wheeler that he's on, it won't go fast enough for him to make major mistakes. It just, it just can't, it only has one gear. Look at that, we got water. We're not catching any of it though. <laughs> oh yeah. Our dam works pretty good. Frozen cinnamon rolls have been on the dough mat for two hours and look at this. They are ready for the oven. Isn't that amazing? Just think of what the rise time would be like if you're just making regular cinnamon rolls. It would be like 20 minutes. This is amazing. Dough mat is a life changer. There is a link in the description below and um, yeah, you can go try it for yourself. Delicious. Look at you. You have no baby. How'd you do on your baby class? Um, I got 98% on the baby. Nice. Yep. That's the amazing. The teacher said that you moved time right. The people that brought the baby back today mm -hmm. did the best job out of anybody. Really? Like they, she got six 100% today. Whoa, how yeah. come you missed 2%? Probably just because head support. There was a couple of times where I missed head support. <laughs> but yeah. Good job, that's awesome. Thanks. Okay, we're finally on our way to the ranch. We are, it's like four o'clock, so we won't get there till probably like five, right? But mom took a little nap so that she didn't fall asleep while she drove, which is a good idea, take a nap before you drive. Learn that in driver's ed even though I already knew that but <laughs> packed all up and we're ready to go okay so we've allowed Canyon to go into second gear now you see we're going a little bit faster which is why he has a helmet on now he's advancing pretty quickly but he can't do this without me yet so we're gonna keep letting him go around get to the point where he understands a little more more comfortable with it, but second gear on his own. Brakes. Okay, good job. What are you guys doing? We got to fix this window before everybody gets here. And guess what? What? Somebody's calling me. Two pieces of glass are separating. What? Man, if I ever had to do this in somebody's house, I would have been hating life. Did you get cut? No, but stand back. Asbury, did you see what I did for you? What? <gasps> yeah! What is it? Cinnamon rolls! Yep, we made cinnamon rolls for you. Woo, I'm so excited. <laughs> look who just made it. Frank and Amara are here. Yes, look at those new boots. Life on the ranch. Yep, you better chase cows now. Oh, the four-wheeler. Nice. 
That's awesome. They're all so big. Are you a daredevil, Charlie? Getting her burger. Yeah. So Gosh. You all right? It's not as Neymar. As Look, he's he's, he's grinding. He's gritting it like on his teeth. <laughs> oh, ew. Neymar. Like, Hurry, give me some water. Agua. <laughs> Did you eat a rock? <laughs> <laughs> was that a rock or was it just? Dirt? It was so much. Was it just a handful of dirt? Yeah. He finally just went for it. Tonight is my first night in two nights, which isn't that long, but I can actually get a full night of sleep because I don't have a baby. I'm actually kind of sad though. I actually like taking care of the baby. It's actually super fun. Even though it was hard to wake up in the middle of the night and everything, it was really fun. I really liked it. And I'm actually tempted to take the class again next year because it was actually so much fun. But it's still sad. I like, I'm like emotionally attached to her now. Even though it's like just a robot baby. I am sad, but I'm also happy because I get to sleep. <laughs> Even though I probably won't sleep that good because this mattress is actually super uncomfortable. It's where these pillows, but we'll see how I sleep. Anyways, I love you guys so much. And as always, you're worth it. Bye guys. Bye.